Hi, this is the walkthrough of the Guardian uh, Cryptic Cr Prize crossword from the 4th of April. A real beast, actually, <clears throat> um, as we'll see. One across, N Native American, dog bites wild cat. So, dog is a chow, well, one type of dog is a chow, and wild cat, an anagram of cat within that word is Choctaw, which is, I didn't know this, I had to look it up, um... A Native American from the South East. So that's us to start. Then we'll have six down. Passionate in a short film. So a vid is a small film. An avid is somebody who's passionate about things. Twenty one across. Dose of mercurial ointment. A cut well it's in the words there uh it's going to be loin as in a cut of meat loin of pork sirloin and then four down <clears throat> arrogant writer originally stuck up i'm repulsed so it's originally <clears throat> um yeah sorry uh writer originally so that's a, and then uh <clears throat> The W and A of uh, arrogant writer going the other way, uh, and it's going to be war, as in evil in war. Contrary granny from Finland posh, everyone agrees. Really tough on this. So, uh, somebody from Finland, we sort of say they're the Suwami people, and Nan is a granny, and if you're posh, it's you. It, that's often used in crosswords. You and non you so posh and you is often um a letter so contrary means going the other way so the whole thing together means everyone agrees unanimous one down storm that's electrical well this is storm as in storm a building uh so charge and 11 across thug denies bombing so if something bombs it goes all over the place um destroyed so it's an anagram of thug, thug denies um and it's gesundheit um a lesser explosion of sneeze in berlin 1960s film back in vogue back so it's in the words going backwards and that's going to be alfie <clears throat> Just popping in the lines here for the clues with more than one word. That's the lot, I think. <clears throat> okay. Okay. <clears throat> Those landed in hot water following Home Secretary reportedly. The Home Secretary is Pretty Patel. Reportedly sounds like a homophone, so it's going to be pretty, uh, the actual word. And then those in hot water, so a pretty kettle of fish. It had to be something like fish there. Not a, a term, again, that I've particularly heard of used much. Three down, make oneself worried. <clears throat> On leaving hospital, one thinks it's broken. So this is going to be an anagram of one think, one thinks it's without the H for hospital, <clears throat> uh, leaving hospital, and it's going to mean make oneself worried. And if you tie yourself in knots, you make yourself worried, and that's what it's going to be. Tie in knots. Let's get that one in. <clears throat> uh, 17 and 12 down. The weak probably wouldn't catch it. Well, uh, given spherical pill, so that's going to be medicine ball, as in the sort of training, the heavy training device. Uh, 27 across, unable to see how maid is mad, so to speak. So maid 
is made into mad without the eye. So we could say eyeless, unable to see. And then 13 down, awful clothes, typical guardian. Anyhow, organ like nothing. So an organ, <coughs> uh, willy. And nothing, like nothing, if something's like nilly, yeah? Anyhow, willy-nilly. Awful clue. Uh, revolutionary ways to secure nail I gathered. So, well, a way is a street, so ways is two streets, like that. And then an anagram of nail I gathered up. Going in, it's going to be Stalinist. Tough, tough on this. Okay, seven, US dancing, bear eating something sticky. Well, something sticky is goo uh, going up inside a bear, and the bear is baloo, which is going to be boogaloo, which was a type of American dancing. Not a, um, my preferred type of dancing, but there we go. 26 across, whacking, cane, flipping, clever idea, pupil finally bending over. Seems really bizarre, where'd you go with that? But actually, it's just all the endings there. It's going to be large, uh, the ends of all the words going over, meaning whacking as in big. Two-wheeler was idling miserably. If you mope around, so it's moped, moped. And then 28, battery not funny, where next, after conviction, where you go to a cell, and if you're not funny, you dry. It's going to be dry cell and 24 down is going to be loft extension. So if you loft something, you might sky it. Extension's beginning. I'm getting a bit behind myself here. Put foot down. It's going to be quicken up. It's going to be quip with um, CU for copper, the chemical symbol. Little boy is just a little boy's name, Ken in this case. Uh, so that's that one. And then um, appropriate names. So name is often just the letter N. Deer is going to, Bambi is a deer attached to a delicate creature. Lacoma is a type of butterfly and butterfly is very delicate. So you put that uh, beforehand and the whole thing is going to mean uh, to appropriate is to commandeer. 14 across. For unfortunate if includes two cryptic. So it's cryptic if includes two with a one going in to make uh, 12 letters, and it's gonna mean unfortunate. So we're gonna write that out. And when we write it out, we can see, we can see, look at the end, it's I blank, O blank, blank. So it's, shus is probably T-O-U-S at the end. Um, and we've got some letters in already. <clears throat> Bit of a big anagram, this one. But it's going to be, have you got it? In felicitous. <laughs> in, uh, hard to say that. In felicitous. Hmm. Anyway, moving on. <clears throat> top cabal so a cabal is a clique and then you top it you take the top off after program a program is an app and that's going to be a plique for a type of uh, needlework tough tough clues these tough clues hunters should first of all kill notorious enemies off so it's an anagram this of should and first of all all kill oh so first of all kill notorious enemy so it's the k and the n and the e the first of all of those as an anagram um off is the anagram and it means uh hunters and it's going to be elk hounds which is a dog used it a hunting dog really tough Okay, and eight down, pale but upright. I think it's going to be listless. Not a particularly good clue, that. I didn't really like it. But uh, there we go. And then this one. I really struggled with this one. 
Um, what's better than twice sighted? Well, I think this is going to be twice sighted four. I think it's just not going to relate to Evelyn War on number four. I think it's four letters twice over. And then well meaning better. Are you well? Are you better? And meaning an author, George Orwell. Really, really, you know, opaque clue for me. And then finally, something tasty served up. Gentle delivery. A gentle delivery is a lob. Um, and gaps are breaks. And if you have that going the other way, it's going to be spag bol, which is something tasty. Awful abbreviation. Watch out for Paul. I don't like this setter. So we'll be wary of him in the future. So there we go. Managed to do it, but a uh, tricky day. See you later.